my ravenous rhino heart. Today we are bringing you Team Elements Zombies. Anyone who knows the channel by now would know that Zombies is one of our favorite decks on the channel and every time we get brand new support, you better believe that we are updating it. Now, with that being said, we have not gotten a ban list yet. This list does change significantly if we get a ban list, but have no fear, it does not actually kill the deck, just rearranges its playstyle a little bit. And with that being said, make sure you stick around to the end of the video, we will be doing a full combo tutorial and test hand to show you guys the lines of the deck and, well, how it works, because it's pretty different. Speaking of sticking around until the end of the video, make sure you come stick around for our subathon! Yay! Yay! September 16th at 3pm EST will be our subathon. We are super excited. Make sure you come join us. Posters right there on the screen. Read it. Keep up to date. I'll have a schedule up next week after we get home from YCS Niagara, which if you're going to be there, make sure you come say hi. I will have stickers, so feel free to come say hi to us at Niagara. I'm super excited to come see y'all. Hopefully you don't get our butts whooped. So with all that being said, we've got a super jam-packed week. It's going to be absolutely wild. I hope you can catch us for all that fun stuff. All the links are in the description box down below. And with all that out of the way, make sure you subscribe, join the sub squad, hit the notification bell, like the video, comment what you think of this deck, and well, what you think is going to get hit on the ban list if we ever even get one because man clock's ticking i don't know what's going on anymore but let's get into the zombie tier deck Ooh, it's fun spooky scary now, this wouldn't be a zombie deck without one copy of unizombie so we're going to start there the one copy of plague spider these are just insane tuners that you can grab off of your copy of needle fiber and then depending on what you mill you can obviously just bring anything and everything back with triple copies of mizuki the one copy of chang shi to send any piece of this combo that you're missing the one necro banshee to get you access to double copies of zombie world we've done about five thousand zombie variant deck profiles on the channel if you need a bigger breakdown on the actual zombie cards themselves i will tag a video right up in the corner feel free to go check it out this is the standard zombie lineup that i've been working with for the last couple months it's been absolutely perfect i do not miss anything i do not think we need anything else and for anyone who does not know we do play three different language mizukis because i need to be able to tell the difference between the english and then the other ones the english one was actually given to us by a very very mm -hmm. dear friend who passed away today is the third anniversary of him not being here with us so this deck Shout is literally, yeah, this deck is literally his baby. Yeah. It's my baby. It's the reason that this deck means yeah. so much to us. So thank you all for hanging with us every time we do a zombie profile. Yeah, thanks for caring, team. And then for the brand new engine, which are the Tier Limit cards, we are on triple copies of Tier Limit Shiren, triple copies of our Tier Limits Merely. Oh my god, the local sprite player is in shambles. And then double copies of arguably the best name, which is Double <laughs> Hoffness. I'm not going to say what I call Hoffness, but if you're on stream, you know what I say about Hoffness. Now, I know Logan called you guys Rhino Hearts in the beginning of the video, but we are uh, actually not playing Rhino Heart because oh. we do not want to have a normal summon in this deck, and that is a Tier Limit card. Just kidding. The long and short of that is that we are not really playing a ton of Tier Limit names, mm -hmm. so if we do put a Rhino Heart in the graveyard, we guaranteed have to have one in our hand to put it back <laughs> onto the field. We, we're just not really trying Half to guarantee Halfness. it. <laughs> Halfness. Halfness. This is just a small engine to help mill cards. To the yeah, game. the Tier Engine is not the core of the deck. This is still a zombie deck through and through with like 67 other engines and the tier engine is just one of them so no there aren't a lot of tier cards and probably for the better i hate this kind of engine Trident is an insane extender because it can pitch any card from your hand to special summon itself and then mill three merely on normal or special summon also just mills three and then hoffness when your opponent activates a monster effect on their field special summons herself from the hand and then mills three as well so these are all just insane extenders and when they are all sent to the graveyard by card effects they allow you to fusion summon using monsters from your hand field or graveyard as fusion material i don't know who designed the tier cards but i just really want to have a conversation because these are absolutely bonkers and the fact that they're aquas and merlies at two and you can make toad i think that's absolutely garbage this deck is ridiculous also this mechanic terrible ban instant fusion and to pair perfectly well with our tier limits we are on triple copies of danger nessie yes. and the one copy of danger mothman Lamp. and then still for one of the best engines in Yu-Gi-Oh, we are playing the one copy of deer note Triple copies of Foxy Toon. Yay. We have bumped up to three copies of Xiamine. This is now our new normal summon. And then obviously triple copies of Emergency Teleport. Golly, there's so much to say about these cards. Punk Engine seems kind of self-explanatory. We've been playing it in Zombies for quite a while now. It's still very, very strong. Itali's still at three. I think that's incorrect. But you know, <laughs> Banlist where, who, Omega lol? I don't know. Also, it's really cool because Foxy Toon doesn't pitch for cost. It pitches for effect, which guess what? That triggers your tears. Crazy. Wow. And then moving off to the band section, we have the <laughs> <laughs> one copy of Jet Synchron, the one copy of Fairy Tail oh, Snow. I hate, I hate, I feel actual hatred. The one copy of Scythe, another one of Logan's favorite cards. You're just cards. annoying. These two are like the table in the cafeteria that you're like, please just like excommunicate yourself. And then it's not really a banned card, but this card is extremely powerful, which is why it is on the limited list at one and one copy of Foolish Burial. They're like the popular table that like you don't like them because they're popular and they're just like 
last night. I'm not gonna use the B word, but you know what I mean. I have very strong arguments <laughs> and feelings as to why two of these four cards should 100% be banned immediately. They're both white. They're both garbage. Uh, but yeah, Snow Scythe, that's pretty good. This deck can abuse the hell out of it, so if you can't beat them, Join them. And then lastly, we are on the one copy of Galaxy Cyclone because Konami refuses to hit Mystic Mine yet, so we will uh, just out that in the main deck. Triple copies of Dark Ruler really just helps out the sprite mm -hmm. board. And triple copies of Forbidden Droplet. This really is just in here to answer window. And then going second, it just allows us to put a bunch of names into our graveyard and start playing. Those are up a little high, but we'll put them over here. There you go. That looks better. And now moving off to the extra deck, we're going to start off with one card that unfortunately will probably not be sticking around, and that is Needle Fight. I don't know. I don't think you shouldn't get banned, but that's, this isn't breakfast and ban list. I know. You can go watch that video if you want. Oh man, crazy, I just plugged it, that's so wild. Uh, I don't think it should be banned, but Needle Fiber is really good. Zombies really relies on it. I think a lot of rogue decks rely on Needle Fiber, so wow, I just tried to say Hulk and Needle Fiber, I said Needle Fiber. <laughs> Regardless, I think a lot of decks, especially rogue ones, rely on Hulk, so I think getting rid of it is honestly like really sad, and I don't think it should go, but what am I? It is what it is. I, who am I? <laughs> I think this is the main culprit. We are still playing the one copy of Dagda. Uh, if Konami's gonna let us play it, we're gonna play it. I think this card absolutely needs to go. I think Scythe needs to go. Genuinely speaking though, we're not really making this card all that often because we're just attempting to mill the Scythe going first and then going second, we are playing obviously the one copy of Dark, the one copy of Unicorn, and then the one copy of Access Code. These are just like our OTK buttons. This, this is Access Code, this is Access Code, and that's Access Code. That's crazy, we're playing three <laughs> Access Code team. And then for another Link 4, we are obviously on the one copy of Appaloosa. This card is absolutely broken. All right, team, eyes on me, eyes on me, okay? These are options. These are not, you're not playing a 16 card extra deck. I know someone in Neville is gonna say it in the comments. You can play one or the other. My eyes are Thanks. Those options are the one copy of Yukiona, the absolute zero Mayakashi, <laughs> or, not and, but or, the one copy of Mech Knight Crusadia. Yeah, Ignite. for all you skipping through the video right now, I'm doxing you being like, oh, what the hell? Why are you <laughs> playing so many cards in your extra deck? Rapport, uh, excuse you, or. I genuinely am just still testing both of these. I actually really like the Yuki Oni more because as good as Avermax is, we do not have room in this deck for IP. So it is actually really vulnerable to destruction, even though it can't be targeted. If your opponent has some way to clear it, just feels bad to sink so many materials into something like this. Whereas the Yuki Ona, while requiring you to have Zombie World face up on the field because it does take two zombie monsters, this card has a double negation effect that you can trigger on your opponent's turn with cards like Snow. The real reason that I honestly like the Yukiona here is because it is a water. In this end board, we are trying to play around Super Poly as much as possible. Mm. Garura is an insane card right now because of Super Poly. So we're just trying to end on something that has different attributes so our opponent can't just auto shotgun Super Poly. Nah, summon the dupe frog off toad in the standby. Come on, do it. You will. For this, it goes super self explanatory. We're it's playing the one copy of Scythe. Yeah, the one copy of our Shooting Riser. Snow. One copy of Chaos Ruler, the other copy of Scythe that's just specials it back from the standby God, phase of your opponent's turn, <laughs> the one copy of Baron, Floor. and then for our fusions we're on the one copy of Kit Kalos, the one copy of Garura, and then the one copy of Predator Plant, Dragos Oh my god, Brian, uh, this might be an obvious question to anyone, but uh, why aren't you playing the Zombie Vampire? You know, the card that builds four from your deck and your opponent. Uh, because there's this tier limit archetype that's really <laughs> broken right yeah, now. Yeah, for anyone wondering why we aren't playing the card, uh, we don't want our opponents winning, that's really bad. And yeah, yeah, that's all that shenanigans fun stuff. It's basically, you know, Scythe Turbo. Let's get into a test hand and combo tutorial and show you how this deck does the thing. All right, team, welcome to the test hand section of the video. We always do a random five card test hand with every single deck profile because we want to show you guys the realistic ceiling that a deck can achieve with any five cards. So with that being said, make sure you come say hi to us at Niagara this weekend. Make sure you join us for the subathon, all that fun stuff. Links in the description box down below. Brian's going to shuffle on up really gracefully here. We're going to cut, <laughs> we're going to draw, and we're going to combo, baby. All right, team, we're going to do a few more of these and boom. Amazing. Do, 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 do. All right, we're gonna start off with one copy of Mizuki. Nice. Oh my God, that's oh, insane. Oh, I love that for you. Itali, Foxy Tune, that's broken. One copy of Droplet, and then the one copy of Ooh, Merely. what a fun little hand. I mean, obviously we opened up the one card combo, which is Emergency Teleport, so we're just gonna start off by firing off our Itali. This is gonna grab us our copy of Ziamine. We're gonna activate the Ziamine's effect now, paying six. Here, we're just gonna grab another copy of Foxy Tune. We do wanna get this Mizuki out of our hand, plus it's just a free card, so we're gonna activate that Foxy Tune's effect now. Now we're gonna pitch the Mizuki in special, our copy of Deer No. Now we're gonna do the uh, normal play here. We're gonna Synchro Summon. Into this godforsaken trash king. Yep, that's gonna be chain link one, chain link two, Deer No. We're just gonna special summon back our copy of Ziamine. Uh, did you cut opponent so that we oh, can have can accurate cut. mills here? I can cut, I can cut. All right, cut. we're gonna mill five. We're gonna see a Foxy Tune, a Chang Chi, absolutely beautiful. Mizuki, Nessie, and Oh my wow. God. Ah! All right, we're gonna really, take the Nessie I here. I really hate it here. That's kind of busted. <laughs> Could you imagine playing against this deck and just 
just seeing that happen. That is just so frustrating. But to beta all of our opponent's interaction, we are just going to use these two for a link summon. And to noodle boo 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 boo
two, and three. Unfortunate, but if you did hit a tier name there, all you have to do is just shuffle that and your copy of the Kit Cows in the graveyard back into the deck, make Drago Stapelia. You still have snow for 88 times. Like it's literally kind of insane. Yeah, super fun to interactive, totally not oppressive. Love that. Ban list, where are you? And that's the deck. It's absolutely bonkers. I love that we constantly get to update zombies. The deck is stronger than Thank ever God. until the ban list comes around and inevitably ruins it because zombies get hit every freaking deck indirectly. Literally. But we're really proud of this deck. Feel free to give it a try. It's still a work in progress. So keep an eye out for updates. But make sure you come say hi to us at YCS Niagara. Make sure you come join us for the Supathon. Check out all our links in the description box down below. And we will see you all very, very soon in one way or another. But thank you guys so much for watching this video. We love you. You matter. And make sure you check out all these videos over here. I didn't forget. Hey. Oh,